Hello, today we are going to talk about run length encoding. Run length encoding is one of the techniques that is used to compress data into more compact format. Why do we need data compression? Because with more compact data format, we can save the data storage. We can also transmit the data more quickly. is a form of a lossless data compression, which runs of sequences having some value occurring many consecutive times. It encodes the sequence to store only a single value and its count. The example of Rotland encoding. Well, how it works is actually scan each data that is going to be compressed. For each item, record the run length. It is the number of times it occurs followed by the item itself. From the data that it shows, the uncompressed data is A, 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 etc. And the compressed one is 5 A's, 5 B's. 6Cs, 6Ds, and 8Es. We can count the size, the uncompressed one, we have 30 data, and the compressed one, we have only 10. Now, let's see the other example. We have the uncompressed data, and also we have the compressed data. Here, we can see that the compressed data is larger than the uncompressed data. In this situation, the compression technique has made the situation worse. That is why it is called as negative compression. We will see the next example. The example is image compression. We have 8 pixels multiplied by 8 pixels image which has only two colors that is black and white but in this image actually it has 16 possible color and the color of its pixels can be encoded with only four bits 8 multiplied by 8 is equals to 64 bits so if each pixel of the image is encoded with four bits of pixel the results will be 256 bits With run-line encoding, the image will be scanned from left to right, row by row, and each row is treated separately. In this image, we consider that the white pixel is 0 and black pixel is 1. The first row is 8, 0, and the second row is 2 zeros, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, and three zeros and for the third and the fourth row we have one zero five one and two zeros and the total of the pixels and the bits that we need if we encode it with four bits of pixels is 160 what if we have different color on each pixel on an image. Of course, it will need more bits if it's compressed. This is called as negative compression because it will need more bits than if it is not compressed. And we arrive at the summary of run length encoding. Run length encoding is a lossless compression technique and it works best on the data that contain long runs of the same value. The example is a black and white image which has more white than the black one.